ratio is now 200 to 500 so I have enough to spare and I'm gonna tr I have two temps and these two temps are gonna be used to harass him I'm gonna, tr I'm gonna try to drop him now and because I need to drop him just because if I don't then I'm gonna be screwed and I need the harassment because as much as it's really hard to harass but if you can get a few harassments in it's really good and as you can see I'm building my cannons on my fourth expansion in a place where okay he's getting queens now you guys might be wondering why he's getting queens just because they can ensnare and if they ensnare it's really hard for me to it's really hard for me to friggin just macro when they're in, when he's ensnaring my queen sorry it's really hard for me to micro when he's ensnaring guys my units because ensnare and he can also do birdling but ensnare is usually what Zerg does with queens I'll show you guys will see how queens are used here uh, you guys have never seen one of my VODs with ensnare because I'm not good enough to use ensnare and so yeah you'll see how ensnare works here and well, okay. Um, I'm I'm, gonna, I'm just trying to mass up my army again. 99 population, 21 minutes in. It's constant battles have been happening. Okay, he is he did see this, but he has to run because if he doesn't run and he keeps his units, try to kill my probes, I'll storm his ass off. And yeah, so he's trying to basically, he's basically. I I need to spread my units apart because if I don't, then I I'm I, again I have three attempts here because look my mineral gas ratio is one. Th I have 1,000 gas now, so I can spare temps. And now I'm just trying to and. I, I'm just trying to storm everywhere now basically just trying to mass storm because storm is really helpful as you can see he did ensnare my units ensnare makes hydras really easy to micro against uh, sorry makes hydras really easy to micro against zealots because ensnare basically means that hydras rape the shit out of zealots because they just move back and attack and he doesn't have his fourth expansion I guess it's not that surprising because he's been spending a whole lot of uh, resources in just macroing hydras and so it's really hard for him he's basically spending all the units he possibly can in mass hydras and that's why he can't micro or he can't produce anything else but yeah I guess as you can see this game is really it's neither neither player is ahead right now I guess I'm actually really ahead right now because I have four ex five expansions almost and he still is down to his three and again I'm trying to just I'm trying to basically just storm every trying to get as much drones as I can here and again, I'm not getting that many, but I'm trying to get as many as I can. And again, I'm just trying to storm this Hydra because I, I want to basically just... I want to just get as many hy drones as I can. And to do that, I, I need to keep his Hydra count down so then he can't attack me. And he did kill this expansion, so I'm going to have to basically just cancel that. And now I'm going to try to... I'm going to see if he has his fourth expansion over there. He might, he might not. And now I'm slowly taking the lead because now I'm econ economically ahead. And now I'm just going to outpower him soon enough. Not right now, but soon enough I will. And yeah, so he's going to pick off my units. He's ensnaring me, as you can see. And my units are moving really, really slowly. So it's really hard. All I, all I, he has to do is dodge the storm. And then the zealots are basically useless because they're very slow and they can't do shit right now. So all he, can do, all he has to do is micro. And then, yeah, I'm trying to basically get out of this ensnare. And ensnare makes units attack slower, move slower, everything slower. So yeah, um... I'm getting Dragoon range right now because I have a mineral gas ratio, basically a 4 to 1 ratio for me to get uh, Dragoons and that's how when you're supposed to get a few Dragoons, that's why I'm getting the Dragoon research because his Hydras are, he's probably going to, he has Hive because he has Queen's Nest so he's slowly going to shift into Ultralang or something and that's why I'm getting Mass Hydras and well yeah, I'm, I, I got lucky here because he didn't think I had another Storm but I did have another Storm and so I just got a few extra storms off there and now he's gonna have to reproduce those drones and if he reproduces drones then he's gonna have le 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 less hydras the more drones he reproduces the less hydras he has and so I'm basically gonna take this game pretty safely now and I have dragoons to counter his queens because dragoons kill queens pretty badly and yeah so this game as far well right now I can't say it's over but hopefully soon enough I have enough temps that I'm just gonna massively storm out everything here and hopefully this storm will just basically kill off everything he has maybe not because he's just microing like crazy and yeah okay well he won this battle just because he microed like really really well this game is all showing you guys if you're a zerg player how badly micro if you're going hydras how badly micro is important as you can see i've had enough times time to storm him and i couldn't storm him because all he did was just massively stop me from storming him and he just micro the only thing keeping him in this game is right now is his micro I'm getting my units here because he might go for he has an overlord here so he might go for my third expansion and if he does then I'm going to have to I'm going to have the ramp, ramp advantage over him and again I'm checking what he has at his fourth expansion because I want to see if he has his hive or not yet and he does have his hive so I'm going to be expecting he might switch to ultra lane really quickly I'm not sure but yeah um guys 
Okay, well, he, yeah, now I have five expansions, he has five, he's about to get four, or five, and this is, is, like, his last army, and if I kill this army, it's GG, guys. Okay, well, um, yeah, this is just about, I'm about to overpower him, basically, as you can see. Okay, GG, guys, hope you enjoyed this video. This was a really good game.